Ooh, there, ladies and gents. This is Connor, and this will be Armored Warfare. So, um, just a quick video on this game. I've unlocked a tank called the OF-40, which came from it's the same tank tree as the Leopard series of German tanks. So it came after the Leopard one, and then I got this, which, you know what? I'm not really sure how to play this thing. And I make a point of not looking online for guides because I kind of like to feel the, the tank out myself. But uh, let's see if we've got any upgrades. I have played a few games with it. And hmm, let's just see. So what is that again? 232. 259. Okay, so it has a lot more penetration, but it doesn't do as much damage. I'll... Hmm. Yeah, let's use a few of these. Don't show that message again. I've already ticked that box like 16 bloody times. Hmm, doesn't seem to work though, so... Uh, garage, and let's see about the ammunition here. Drag that out of there. Uh, is that the one? Yeah, that's the one. Right, let's put that down to about... Hmm, 35 shells? Alright. There we go. Confirm. Now let's take it into a battle. See how this thing actually should be played you know i've played a few games as i said i've played a few games with it but it's just been dead within the first five to ten minutes of the game it's horrible so here we are in a game what map is this again uh cold strike so i like this map and we seem to have started off on the hill side of the map and the tank itself it does look pretty damn cool looks pretty modern and the reason I'm going down through the Leopard line is because I personally believe, I think it's even been proven, that the uh, Leopard that they use in the German army right now is the best battle tank to date. Most advanced hardware, uh, the best gun. Uh, people say the Abrams is the best tank. The Abrams is a good tank, but it's been serving for quite a long time now. And, I mean, it gets modified heavily, but... I don't know, I just think the Leopard overall looks cooler. I was going to go down the Abrams line as well, then I just realised how long it would take to grind out two tanks. Especially with paying for the premium over and over again, just to grind out the the two tank trees that I need to get through. I also want the Chieftain, so <laughs> there's going to be a lot of tanks I want. Right, so I'm heading up this hill here. Seems to be a lot of members of my team up here. And it is a tier 6 game. Which is horrifying. I'm a tier 4 of course. Look at the size of that gun. Is that not the derpiest thing you've ever seen in your life? Look at it. Looks like an April Fools type thing. Right, so no enemies. Oh, getting a little bit of lag. My computer's had a few problems with this game. Trying to run it at a constant 60 F. Whoa, sorry mate. At a constant 60 FPS. And I don't think there is proper SLI support yet. Because uh, I can play Crisis. Uh, of course it is using the Crytek engine. But I can play games like Crisis. And let's just see. Is he behind? He must be behind cover. I can play games like Crisis 3. 100 FPS constantly with everything up maxed. So yeah I just. I'm waiting for them to actually. Tweak the SLI support. I have two GTX 680s. Uh, I think they're both 4 gig each. Right, so heading into the city here. Oh, Leopard 1F5 spotted. That's the tank I'll get after this one. Shout out. Hit. I've been spotted, so I need to move fast here. There's another OF 40. He's out of line of sight. And I'm going to load this uh, heat round. Heat shell after the current. What is it again? Whatever it is. You know, I enjoy tank games. The World of Tanks and the like. War Thunder. But, you know, I'm not a master of tank knowledge. There's so many different freaking ammo types. It's ridiculous. See if we can get a... No, he's behind cover.
They're behind cover. See, it's a big uh, change from playing as the Leopard 1. The Leopard 1 is a really quick tank. It's really good at firing on the move. This thing, not so much. I mean, 30 kilometers. Target taken out. Yep, hit our fuel. That hurt. That's that Leopard 1. FA variant. Big hit there. Got him back for it at least. Where's some tank in front of me? T72. T90 looks pretty damn awesome, doesn't it? The modern Russian tank. Looks like something out of Terminators. The amount of bloody red lights and stuff on it. How heavily modified it is. Uh oh. Why is he seeing me? I can't even see him. Expeditionary tank there, little toady things, like really, really small. I do have smoke launchers as well, get me out of harm's way really quickly, but of course, if I'm still there, and this is a slow tank, they're going to hit me. Uh, it doesn't look like it's going too well here. What do you want me to push into? Do you want me to die? Is he dead? You know what, I'm going to try and move up here. I've been spotted. Target down. There's two kills so far. Not doing too badly. Ah, uh, that Leopard 1FA is going to check me out here. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Need to get in the cover. Ow, that hurt. Need to get in the cover, need to get in the cover, need to get in the cover fast. Come on, come on, come on. Damn it! This thing is so slow. But it's my fault anyway. I mean, people who in chat who say go, 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 move, 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 even though they're dead. Because it worked out so well for them. This happens in World of Tanks as well. I mean, you have to be cautious. cautious. Look at this guy hiding in this bush. I mean... Is that a bot? I mean, because he's not in view of anything. The size of that gun. That is the derpiest thing I've ever seen in my life. I mean... He's obviously overcompensating for someone. Can I, like, remove the UI or something? Uh, I don't think so. Probably is a key to do it. I just don't know what it is. I mean, look at the team chat here. F and idiots here, F and idiots there. Klein team. And those guys were one of the couple that died pretty early in. But I got two kills. That isn't too bad. Also did damage to a couple of other tanks in the game. This thing is so derpy. I can't get over the size of that gun. And of course it's American. <laughs> oh, that is the derpiest thing I've ever seen in my life. What is that, the M109? Jesus, that gun's big. Whoa, what was that, MIG? I mean, this game is beautiful. There's always stuff going on around you, whether it be choppers flying into combat. I mean, they don't actually take part in the battle, but... It's awesome that they do have the effects and stuff. Everything's There's always something going on. Nothing's really all that static. There's chaos everywhere. Oh, come on, come on, M109, M109, he's right there, take him out. Look at the size, I can't get over the size of that gun. It's f <laughs> it looks like it's a bug or something, like it's... Is that him shooting? Sounds like he's shooting pixie dust or something. Let's take a look at the other guy. Oh, two already left, okay. Don't, what, dude, what are you doing? Dude, what are you doing? Wow, he survived that. Oh, he's, he's gonna get wrecked, he's gonna die, yeah. Why would he do that? They had to come up to get him, so... As soon as they came around the corner, he gotta just derp them in the face. So there we go, that's the OF-40, I mean... It is a nice tank, I think I need to get the engine upgrade, but I don't know if that's really going to increase... 
the overall top speed of it. I have reached like 50 kilometers, but it, it takes a long, long time to accelerate this thing and get it up and run. Uh, so thanks for watching. I didn't win, but at least I tried my best. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to. If you don't want to, then do it anyway. Bye-bye.